for Sergey, uncharacteristic opening laps. The fact that he apparently was not familiar with the position after the 15th move is, is very uncharacteristic for him. I mean, he is no slouch either in the realm of opening preparation. The guy has played a world championship match and he goes for one of the sharpest lines of the, of the same variation. And he ran out of his prep a lot earlier than a lot earlier than Sam. And this is not a position where, where you can afford to be out of prep. It's as simple as that. And uh, Sam puni punished him uh, ruthlessly. Uh, this is about to be a, a crushing, a crushing win. We were saying, Sam, of course, there was absolutely no need for him to apologize for the quick draw with the black pieces. But if he feels that way, well, today he certainly uh, redeemed himself. There he goes, Rook AC1. The killer move has been played, I believe. Yes. It has. It has. Rook A to C1 is on the board. And now we're looking at Karyakin, who I think he already knew for a couple of moves. This one was gone, but uh, we've just gone to every single move. There is absolutely nothing he can do here. There is only, I think, one move. If he doesn't resign... And he resigns, gonna... Dania. He you resigns. called it. You called it. Wow. <laughs> You resign, and, and, and this is not a premature resignation. The game is over. There isn't even a way to force an end game. White is just winning the queen here. So this is an insane result. And if, we, if you told me, Fiona, that there would be a game over in an hour and 48 minutes, I would have never predicted it to be a decisive result. 